Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. Well, Mammoth Mountain Volcano, another sign of recharging for a coming eruption one day, had a magnitude 4.0 earthquake. It was about 8 miles west of Tom's Place, California, or 13 kilometers. 160 people reported feeling this earthquake, and normally only about 10% of people report earthquakes. The Moment Tensor Ball. You can see here we have uplift. The initial first wave of the earthquake came from the northwest a little bit. Tension was applied. Going northeast, we got dipping of the fault line slightly. You can see that here going oh, down, of course, dipping. And then towards the east a little bit. Basically, mostly towards the south. Since this magnitude 4.0 earthquake, there's been a 0 0.8, a 1.6, a 1.4, a 1.5, and a 1.2. Using Google Earth, right down here, kind of in the middle at the bottom, is the 4.0. Up here, we got Mammoth Lakes, etc., uh, Crowley Lake. These are different earthquakes that I recorded in the past. Uh, this 3.0 um, that was back on September 25th. I also have on here different eruptions. Um, these basically all occurred at the same time. They were one of the most recent eruptions. And then further up north we have the Mono Inyo craters. And according to research they have eruptions along this chain every two to seven hundred years. And they really emphasize that you have nothing to worry about. Here on USGS, we have the location of some of these more recent earthquakes, the 1.4, the 1.2, 1.5, and the 1.6. The upper earthquakes, the shallow earthquakes as they call them, example the 1.1 is the result because the crust of the earth is very brittle from the uplift, from the recharging of this volcano. Here's a waveform of that earthquake. Yeah, you can see that it lasted quite a while. They believe that the CO2 that comes up in this area is from an areas of dike intrusion. Actually, hasn't broken through to the surface like what we've seen in Hawaii. And the magma comes up very deep from the earth. One research paper, which Google has an image here, of shows the different directions that the uh, magma rises up from and yeah I don't think you can see that how deep that is yeah shallow earthquakes uh, brittle um, ductile transition and the intrusion as it comes in this is a paper from science advances showing deep fluid pathways beneath mammoth mountain now here's mammoth mountain Okay, and this is the Long Valley Caldera. Can you see the dotted lines? There, I went to the uh, location of the paper. Yeah, there's the dotted lines. And here we have Mammoth Mountain. We'll go back to the location of this earthquake. All right, there we go. Mammoth Lakes. There's the 4.0, or the 4.0, excuse me. Crowley Lake. All right, and that very well could be Crowley Lake right there. So this earthquake would be right along the rim, the edge, or close to the edge of the uh, caldera. And there's Crowley Lake, and there's the 4.0. I'll pull this over for you. I'll give you a link to that research paper. It'll be at the end of this video and also down below in the more information box below the video. And then we'll go back to the earthquakes that USGS is reporting. I went a little bit too large there. There we go. This one right here, the 0 0.8 was only 1.1 kilometers in depth. The 1.4 was very deep, very deep. 18.8 um, .8 kilometers in depth. So that would be about 11 miles um, below sea level. They're all measured from sea level. Um, this one here was 9.7 uh, kilometers in depth. So that would be about six miles in depth. That one too. Yep, same, about the same depth. 
um, that one too, the 1 1.5, about the same. Just shows you that magma is on the move for the recharging for the next <laughs> eruption. Um, yeah, um, anywhere between two and 500 years, right? But they keep telling us there is nothing to worry about. Within this area of the caldera, yeah, there's a lot of population. We've got an airport here. Uh, Whitmore Hot Springs. I'm not sure what that is there. Oh, that's the uh, the water plant for the purification, I think, for the sewer. Um, an industrial park. So there's the airport. Yeah, the kids are up. And then, yeah, we got all this here. All these people. So that's all I have for you right now. Um, if you have any thoughts or comments or questions, put it down below. Thank you for subscribing. Happy New Year. Um, please stay safe. Thank you for your support. Thank you for subscribing. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.